What's up, y'all? This is Rick, fixing to show you how to do a double edge up. As you can see, we've already done the edge up. Make sure your edge up is precise prior to starting. Make sure your points are even, points on the sides are even, your lineup's correct, because if not, your double edge is going to look like crap. So, you just go about this much further back, like not even, I don't know what that is, quarter inch so. And then just, I always start at the center, just dab it with the line like that. And there you go. Now you just start on, follow your edge up line to do your double. Make sure not to go too thick, but you don't want to go too thin as well, because then it won't be noticeable. <laughs> your sides pointing out just a little bit further than your corner there. Not too much. That's good enough. And just come down with it. Curve your points the same way you would. I normally like to come back around this way, point it over the ears, and then I'll come back and make that point. Come back here and make this point. Make sure you use your tip. We're done with this side. Same way over here. I got a habit of putting it upside down for the other side. You can do it regular or you can pull it upside down. I just like doing it upside down because you can see it more than if it, you had it up upright. Point in.
Like I said, I like to come back around this way. I'm not connect it yet. Just bring it over. Around the ear. Now right, you'll come back right there and you'll make the point. And if you need to, you can come back around and look at some of these spots that you think may need to be evened out. If one's not as thick as another spot. That, my friend, is what a complete double edge up should look like. Check you out the next episode.